If you're anything like me, your nightly routine may unfold something like this. After a tiring day, you diligently brush your teeth, don your Zelda-themed pajamas, jump into bed, turn off the lights, and then nothing. Not the comforting kind of nothing. You attempt to shut your eyes tighter, ponder if your sleeping position is to blame, or perhaps you're just not comfortable enough. But no, none of these efforts prove successful. As the clock ticks away, you become acutely aware of each passing second, losing precious sleep time and anticipating a challenging tomorrow. If only you could go back to the simplicity of sleeping at school or work. The solitude of the night brings forth only your deepest, darkest thoughts and the relentless ticking of that dreaded clock. If this scenario strikes a chord with you, this video has you covered. We've gathered some of the most effective advice and practices to enhance your chances of swiftly falling asleep. We'll begin with seven things to do before jumping to bed. Tip one, sleep in a colder environment. Your thermal environment plays a crucial role in determining both how quickly you'll fall asleep and the overall quality of your sleep. This often overlooked factor extends beyond merely feeling cozy under your blankets. Whether it's heavy pajamas, thick blankets, or a hot room, overheating can disrupt your sleep cycles. Studies have shown that excessive warmth, especially around your head and body, can decrease a slow wave sleep and REM sleep. Therefore, creating a cooler sleeping environment actually facilitates a quicker drop in body temperature, promoting a faster onset of sleep. The recommended room temperature for optimal sleep is around 65 degrees Fahrenheit or 18.3 degrees Celsius. It's worth noting that while a colder room is beneficial, going too cold doesn't seem to have the same disruptive effects on falling asleep or sleep quality as a warm room does. Tip two, take a hot shower or bath before bed. Contrary to popular belief, feeling warm and fuzzy isn't necessarily the ticket to a good night's sleep. Taking a hot shower or bath before bedtime can have a calming effect on your body and mind. When you expose your body to elevated temperatures, blood rushes to the surface of your skin, creating a flushed appearance. Once you step out of the warmth, the blood vessels dilate, radiating heat to the environment, and your core body temperature drops. This decrease in core temperature signals to your body and brain that it's time to wind down and prepare for sleep. The key here is the contrast between the warm shower and the subsequent cool down period, which mimics the natural temperature drop your body undergoes before sleep. So, if you're struggling to transition from a busy day to a restful night, consider incorporating a hot shower or bath into your pre-sleep routine to ease the way into a more tranquil state of mind. Tip three. Put away the clock. The simple act of putting away the clock can have a profound impact on your ability to fall asleep. Constantly checking the time while lying in bed can create a counterproductive cycle of stress and anxiety. Watching the minutes tick by may lead to heightened awareness of how much time you're spending awake, potentially triggering worry about the impending challenges of the day ahead. This heightened stress can contribute to waking arousal, making it even more difficult to transition into a restful state. By banishing the clock from your immediate view, you remove the visual cue that often fuels unnecessary stress related to sleep. Instead, focus on creating a calming environment that promotes relaxation, making it easier for your mind to shift into sleep mode without the added pressure of time ticking away. Tip four, minimize or avoid caffeine and nicotine. What you consume during the day, especially in the hours leading up to bedtime, can significantly impact your ability to fall asleep. Caffeine, found in coffee, colas, tea, and even chocolate, is a stimulant that can linger in your system for hours. It takes time for your body to metabolize and eliminate caffeine fully, so consuming it too late in the day can interfere with your ability to wind down. Similarly, nicotine is another stimulant that can disrupt your sleep patterns. Whether from cigarettes or other sources, nicotine can keep your mind and body alert making it challenging to relax and initiate sleep. To optimize your chances of falling asleep quickly, it's advisable to minimize or avoid the consumption of caffeine and nicotine, especially in the hours leading up to bedtime. This includes being mindful of not only beverages, but also food and other products that might contain these stimulants. Additionally, avoiding heavy meals close to bedtime can contribute to a more comfortable and restful night's sleep. Tip five, exercise. 
Physical activity plays a significant role in promoting restful sleep, but the timing of your workouts is crucial. Engaging in exercise, whether it's aerobic or strength training, can contribute to being physically tired, making it easier to fall asleep. However, the timing of your exercise routine matters. Working out too close to bedtime can have the opposite effect, as it raises your core body temperature and stimulates your nervous system, potentially making it harder to wind down. To maximize the sleep-inducing benefits of exercise, aim to complete your workouts earlier in the day. This allows your body temperature to naturally decline in the evening, aligning with your body's internal signals for sleep. While exercise is beneficial, it's advisable to avoid intense physical activity within two to three hours of bedtime. Tip six, relax before bed. Creating a relaxed state of mind before bedtime is essential for a smooth transition into sleep. If you attempt to sleep while feeling wired or on edge, your brain may resist the calming signals needed for a restful night. Establishing a pre-sleep routine that includes calming activities is key. Engaging in a relaxing activity within the hour before bedtime, such as reading a book or practicing gentle stretches, signals to your brain that it's time to wind down. This ritual helps shift your focus away from the day's stressors and prepares your mind for a restful night. Much like a winding down process, engaging in activities that promote relaxation contributes to creating a conducive environment for falling asleep faster. Consistency is key with pre-sleep relaxation routines. By incorporating calming activities regularly, your brain learns to associate these rituals with sleep, making it easier to transition into a restful state when you lay down for the night. Tip 7. Sun Exposure Sun exposure plays a crucial role in regulating your body's internal clock, also known as the circadian rhythm. Ensuring that you get exposure to natural sunlight during the day and minimizing light exposure during the evening can significantly impact your sleep-wake cycle. Getting at least 30 minutes of natural sunlight each day helps condition your body to recognize the appropriate times for wakefulness and sleep. Exposure to sunlight in the morning is particularly beneficial as it helps set your internal clock and promotes alertness during the day. Conversely, minimizing exposure to artificial light, especially blue light emitted by screens, in the evening signals to your body that it's time to wind down. This is crucial for the production of melatonin, a hormone that regulates sleep. While it's common advice to avoid screens before bedtime, it's equally important to prioritize natural sunlight exposure during the day. Striking the right balance between light exposure and darkness enhances your body's ability to maintain a healthy sleep-wake cycle. Now that we've established some conditions to enhance your ability to fall asleep, and yet, here you are, still wide awake. Perhaps you've diligently followed the recommendations and find yourself lying in bed, desperately searching for ways to speed up the process on YouTube, leading you to this very video. No need to deny it. If that's the case, you've unfortunately broken rule number seven by peeking at your phone. But in all honesty, I'll forgive you if it was out of sheer desperation. I mean, I won't complain about the extra view. But joking aside, if you're still lying in bed after trying all those tips, there's a technique reportedly used by the Navy that could have you asleep in a mere two minutes, regardless of your location. I use the term allegedly because the studies supporting this method aren't publicly available. However, the claim is that it was designed for fighter pilots facing avoidable mistakes due to stress and, consequently, lack of sleep. These techniques were intended to enable them to fall asleep even while sitting up. According to their assertions, after six weeks of practice, 96% of the pilots could drift off in less than two minutes. Here's how it works. Begin by systematically relaxing each part of your body. Take a deep breath, close your eyes, and focus on relaxing your face. Then progress down your body, tightening and relaxing every muscle. After addressing every part of your body, shift to clearing your mind in a meditative state. If thoughts persist, repeat the words, don't think, for 10 seconds. It may sound simple, but practice is key. Consistency also matters. While it may not work instantly, weeks in, you're more likely to achieve proper sleep. One more crucial tip. Go to bed and wake up at the same time daily, even on weekends. It may not be thrilling advice, 
but we're creatures of habit, and a consistent routine helps your body work like clockwork. Thanks for watching. Please hit that like and subscribe button for more content like this. See ya.